Hello and welcome to my travel vlog to Argasi and Zakifanos on the island of Zanti. Here was our route on the plane before getting a transfer to our hotel which was Hotel Admiral Argasi. We got this beautiful watermelon drink on welcome and I met this cat on the first day and named him Jupiter and I ended up seeing him every day which was lovely. Here is a sneak peek of my room. It was really spacious and I really enjoyed my stay here. Then before getting ready and spending the day or the rest of the day by the pool and starting on my needed tan. Then I got ready for dinner but just before we decided to go on a walk to just familiarise ourselves with where we were staying, what was around to just get a good feel. Now this was the beach near the hotel and this is the bridge called the Argasi Bridge but it was nice to just see the sea the beach wasn't the best here but then we returned back for dinner and this was the dessert choice we stayed in an all-inclusive hotel and I was just really impressed by the dessert choice the dinner was lovely too before just chilling by the pool and having a drink then on the Saturday we decided to have a pool day and after doing my masters I really needed this pool day because I've been so burnt out so it was so lovely to just chill do some reading enjoy some lunch at the hotel before in the afternoon having some delicious cocktails and just sunbathing getting my tan on and I got ready for the evening had some more drinks, had some dinner at the hotel before going for a little walk again in the evening, met some more lovely cats and me and my mum got matching anklets and then there was some entertainment at the hotel too. Then on Sunday it started off quite chilled by the pool again. I did some reading, I really wish I bought two books because I went through this book so fast. Then before the trip I did some market research and found some nice restaurants because it was my mum's birthday in a few days I took her to pick out of the four and these were some of them. They were all lovely but they all had like different pros and cons. You'll see later in the video which one she picks out of the four. But after that we just returned to the hotel and had some more drinks and then in bed I just decided to chill and watch a Molly Mae YouTube video. Then on Monday, again another pool day, I was just enjoying the hotel so much that we didn't really leave the first few days but later on in the video you'll see we do leave and we get up to some exciting activities and excursions but this is me getting ready for dinner. This was my dinner at the hotel and again showing you the desserts because I'm not a dessert person but I just love how aesthetically pleasing they are. Then literally at the end of the road from the hotel there's this lovely bar called 360 Sky Bar. I just love the vibe, the decor, I really really liked it here. And we just went for a little drink before returning and watching these dancers at the hotel. It's really nice that they put entertainment on most nights and then just went to bed. Now on Tuesday we decided to have a day out of the hotel and we hired a car which we named Percy. We went for a little drive around and saw this harbour then went to this beach which I'm not going to try and pronounce because I'll probably butcher it but this beach was really nice if you really liked water sports and stuff like that. Then we did return to the hotel and had some lunch. Then we went to go and see a monastery but it was so high up that my mum got scared so we decided to go to this beach called Porto Zorro Beach and this was absolutely stunning. I would really recommend going here because it's just so calming and relaxing and then we decided to go back to the hotel, get ready for dinner. This was like our little routine every night. We did the same walk, had some dinner and then went to the pool and had a glass of Prosecco which was lovely. Now on Wednesday was my mum's birthday. We took her cards, present and a cup of tea into her room before taking her on this trip to go and pick up our private boat. Here's a map of where we could go. So we picked up our boat. There was four of us on the boat. We were in charge of driving it, which was very fun and very interesting. But we had the boat for three hours and you could just see so much, really get a good feel for the island. There's me and my brother, we've just anchored the boat and just chilling on this island which was beautiful and having some snacks and refreshments before kind of keep travelling, having a look. We did have a bit of a crash in the boat but it was quickly fixed. <laughs>
ride, we went and visited Cameo Island before getting a transfer back to the hotel, having a sunbathe and then getting ready for our meal. Now my mum picked Al Noor as her birthday venue location. It's an absolutely beautiful restaurant. She was really chuffed. The view is definitely what sells it. And here is our food. Now I had a really bad envy of my brother's meal because he had the steak and it was gorgeous. Here's my mum with her 40th birthday candles before we returned back to the hotel to have a drink and then retire to bed. Now Thursday was our penultimate day so we definitely just chilled this day, topped up our tans, really relaxed, then got ready for dinner and went out and saw Jupiter for one last time. It was honestly adorable, there were so many cats around the area before getting souvenirs for our loved ones and then coming back to the hotel and enjoying some more entertainment. Then on Friday we got up, had some breakfast before leaving, getting to the airport and travelling home but the trip was honestly fantastic. I definitely recommend going but thank you very much for watching and I hope you have a lovely day.